Hey, what's good family? Recently started a challenge where I am trading options starting with $100 that I started this week. I'm, I'm going until October the 25th. And just this week alone, we've already made some decent progress. If you want to follow along for this journey, be sure to hop on and join the lives in the morning. Now, as the week has come to a close, I want to take a moment to reflect on the trades that we were able to take this week. So without further ado, Let's take a look. So we started with $100 this week. The first trade that we took was a put on Intel, which actually came from one of the family uh, present during the live stream. They pointed out the chart for Intel. We saw the setup. We took the trade. Uh, we bought it on Monday and we sold out on Tuesday. So we bought in, we paid $78 per share and we sold out, took profits of $126.97 or 127. So right there, off the first trade, we're already up $49, off to a great start for the week. Now going on to the next trade, this was a four day week, so I believe we got four trades this week. The next trade that we took, we bought a 114 call on Nvidia. We bought in at 9.49 CDT, which is central time. So we bought a little over an hour in the market open, paid $71 for the trade and sold out for $84. That right there is an extra $13 of profit, bringing our total profit to $62. May not be the largest profit, but profit is profit. So, hey, we kept moving on. The next day, uh, we grabbed a 112 call on Nvidia, uh, bought in at $60. But the thing is, I was personally out of day trades and Nvidia looked like it was gonna re reverse. So I had to kind of do this thing uh, if you were on the stream and you had a day trade, I believe we would have been up about $28 at the time I was trying to take profits. But when I was trying to take profits, I had no day trade. I didn't want to become a pattern day trader. So what I did was I took the next contract out, a 113 call, and I sold it again. So we bought in for $60. I sold that next contract for $53, leaving me with the spread. And had NVIDIA actually gone up, I would have also, I, I could have also profited off of the difference between the two contracts, which would have left me a max potential profit of $93. So the net result of this trade uh, for me was losing $7, but for most of the people who were on the stream, you actually profited because this was not a strategy I went into. It wasn't anything that I felt was necessary for anybody trading. And the majority of people watching the stream and trading with this amount is using a cash account. And now with that LI took, we're down to being up $55 on the week, 55% on the week, which I'm still stoked about. So going on, let's actually see what we did today. Today was a zero day to expiration Friday. Uh, with these, they like to play a game. So I was not trying to stick around to play. So. We bought a 102 NVIDIA put about 32 minutes in the market open. We paid $42 for it. And at the beginning of the day, it seemed hopeless. It seemed like it was gonna expire worthless, but I was playing with profits. So I was willing to kind of entertain and see what happened. Going on just about 32 minutes later, I was able to sell out at $65 for a profit of $23, which is actually more than a 50% return on today's trade. And on top of that, it brought our total for the week to $78. It's been a while since I've done one of these challenges. I'm really enjoying doing these on stream. In the past, I've done 52 week challenges. They haven't fared out well for me. I've had targets. Uh, like a 10% weekly target, which we actually kind of destroyed this week. But as time goes on, that gets more difficult as a account gets bigger. Really the purpose of this challenge for me is to build up good habits, good consistency, get good with finding good contracts, contracts that'll move uh, with a little bit of amount that I can actually scale up. So for instance, instead of me buying expensive $500 contracts. I, I can buy 50 of these contracts, what I'm getting, or maybe instead of buying $500 contracts, I can get 
10 of one of these contracts and yield much better profits in the trade. Uh, also, I find doing this challenge to be a lot of fun because on the live stream, I'm able to connect with you guys. I'm able to help educate in areas where I see you're struggling. And all in all, it's just cool having people to trade with. If you haven't already taken advantage of it, be sure to check out the Moomoo referral link down below in the description. They are offering up to 15 free stocks when you sign up and make a deposit using that link. If you enjoyed this video or learned anything, be sure to smash the like button. If you made it this far in the video and for some reason you're not already, be sure to subscribe, hit the bell notification icon so that you don't miss any future content, especially not any live streams. And last, but certainly not least, thank you so much for watching. Matthew Manuel signing off, and I want to change your life.